Well, the Young Scientist exhibition has become such a major feature in the calendar every year, but it's become more than that. It's become a catalyst uh, for the next generation of leaders in a whole variety of STEM subjects. And to meet so many young people who have had their interests sparked in science, in technology, in curiosity is really inspiring. So well done to everybody. What impresses me most is the originality in terms of the projects that the students choose in the first instance, their capacity to articulate and tell the story about their project. And I'm always enthused by the newer type of projects that emerge. AI is very prevalent in this year's uh, exhibition and, it's very, and, and, and the command on AI of the students is quite breathtaking. One of the reasons I love coming here every year is because it's a great uh, vehicle for encouraging interest in science and the STEM subjects more generally. So I think it's uh, incredibly positive for increased participation in STEM and that's improving in Ireland all of the time in terms of young women in particular. Hugely impressed again this year by the students here at the BT Young Scientist and the RDS. As ever, the enthusiasm, the passion, the knowledge and expertise is mind-blowing. I mean, this is a highlight for me every year, but this year I've just been blown away. I want to encourage everybody who's got involved in the exhibition to keep at it. You have such a major impact to play in your community, in your country, and we need you. The world needs that next generation of thought leaders, of scientists, of innovators. And I'm absolutely living here today, absolutely certain in the knowledge that the future of our country is in good hands.